Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. So today we have some more birthday entries. Um, the deadline to mail out everyone's packages was August 31st. So I did receive lots of messages um, that everybody was mailing everything out on Saturday. So I do know that I have a few more coming in. But as far as that, whatever comes in between now and by December, not December, September 13th, I will be announcing the winners on that day, on the 13th of September. So I should have everybody's um, packages by then. All right, so today's going to be 66 through 70, if my uh, camera lets me. <laughs> so this one here comes from Lisa, which is my friend here on YouTube, um, Lisa's um, Happy Crafter Shop. And the first thing that she um, included on top of the box was a sweet, sweet little card. Love this card. I love the color she used. That pink and orange. So pretty. It says, happy birthday. And that is her information. Of course, I'll leave um, that also in the description box. Aw, thank you. She did leave a note so I can reuse this card. So thank you so much. Oh wow, she filled this box up with fun goodies. Let's see what she made here. Oh, it looks like um, like a little tote. How cute. Now I know she's a design team member for um, Anna, my, is it my, Anna's Handmade Crop. Oh, I don't know, I forgot her name. But um, she sells also dyes and stuff. And I recently purchased a dye from her shop, um, a Crafty Sentiments. So I will leave um, that information as well. But I think this could be a dye from her shop, maybe. How cute is this? So there's like pockets on all four sides. And let's see. I guess there's no. Um, we'll just start here. She included these beautiful little buttons. How cute are those? I'm loving the back topper. I'm actually working with this collection for one of my swaps. So this is going to come in handy for that. Thank you so, so much. Oh, she even included the little sticky, sticky dots. So pretty. So, so pretty. And then in here, oh, she included some of those, um, that black chiffon trim. And then look at the fun little back topper that she did as well. So fun. And then she included some more of her, she just released um, her Halloween bouquet, which was available yesterday. So if you haven't checked it out or checked my unboxing for um, this September's release, she included this black pom-pom trim in there. <coughs> oh, I've always wondered, oh my gosh, she even included my information. I've seen so many people use these cards. It says, you have received a swap or entry, winnings, happy mail, you just circle whatever one, and then you put who it's to, who it's from, what date you sent it. It says, from It's a Deal, YouTube, It's a Deal. Oh my gosh, this is so awesome. Thank you, Lisa. This is so sweet of you. I appreciate this very much. And then this last one here. Uh, look at all the colors of Diamond Dots that she used to coordinate with the collection. This is perfect. Another beautiful happy topper, happy topper, <laughs> happy, um, I was reading that and thinking of back topper, happy Halloween back topper. Again, with the beautiful floral piece. And Lisa does these flowers. She does an amazing job. Wow, okay, so we're gonna move this little handle here. The cool thing about this too, that she didn't decorate any part of this, so I can definitely reuse this craft tote as well. So how exciting is that? So this is the little bow box, so cute. And this was um, part of her last month's design team or uh, August release and love it. Again, she didn't do anything to it, so I'm able to reuse it. Now let's see what's, ooh, looks like she included some bows, of course, for the bow box. And I think one just flew out. Here we go. I think it's supposed to be like this. 
again this is going to go perfect with some of the things i'm working on so less work for me we have the two glittered bows and then these here and then she also again left the sorry about the glare this is that cricket um craft paper it's so pretty and then um she left the centers empty so i can do what i'd like here's some extra bows here love and look at such a cute idea she actually did it like how a store would do it oh i really like how you did that i'm gonna have to get this idea try this out for a swap this is so fun i love how you did this thank you awesome awesome okay so let's put this back in here and you can see like there was still room to put more in here like she th these boxes are awesome for swaps i don't want to get this everything there we go there we go and then we have these beautiful flowers oh my gosh this just came at the perfect timing <laughs> i love them and then ooh, look at these and look at the presentation it's like in a um plastic clear box so cool i'm loving how she added some green in there as well these are so pretty and we have a little um spatula which we use for um dangles oh my gosh look at this cute little um teddy bear dangle that is so cool this is really cute I love the size of this. Lisa, you have to let me know where you got this size because these are perfect for the small spoons. So, and for like the the small pokey tools. Yeah, let me know where you got that bag because I need some. And then she included some more bows. Girl, she knows I, I hate making bows. <laughs> she hooked me up. And then this packaging, like I can reuse this all. Oh, so love it. Lisa, you are amazing. And then look at, she included some crepe, um, regular rosettes. She added tulle on this one, this one, and this one. Again, plain for me to decorate as I please. Oh my gosh. And this box is like heavy duty as well. Perfect. I'm going to keep all this in here. So when I'm working on that swap, I have things that I can play with. This is just absolutely amazing. So, so cute. Can even slide that card in there just like that you can fill so much in here so so cute thank you lisa all right so number 67 comes from zenobia all right so um, i'm not sure about her or social media information so we'll get into the card and see so fun she wrapped up everything in happy birthday wrapping paper says hi there so fun okay so she um used a fairly old maggie holmes collection all right so cool thank you well it just has her name on there so i'm not sure As I'm recording, my um, phone was ringing for my best friend. <laughs> of course, I didn't answer because I didn't want to ruin my video, but I'm reading her message and it's making me laugh. But anyways, <laughs> um, look at the beautiful memory decks card that she made. A shaker. So pretty. I don't know. Yeah, this is definitely an older Maggie Holmes collection. How sweet. And she was um, able to create something for me for with that collection. I love this. So pretty. Let's see if there's information on the back of the card. Okay, perfect. Yes, there was. Um, she does have her information. So her birthday is in October, and then her um, Instagram is Craft at Home, and then her YouTube channel is Craft at Home ZN. So I'll be sure to leave that link down below. So pretty. 
love it i love the colors so cute i've been using that um memory decks holder that i received in my challenge with all these memory decks that i've been recently getting so that has came in handy for sure all right and we have one other little package here and i don't have any more um of my cutters my son has also got into like de uh, shirt designs and so he's been using like my crafty stuff so he took my blades he's been taking my um cutting boards yeah so i have this that um someone made me so i've been using this let's see so she included a really fun ma sheet mask brilliant sea boost love me some um, face masks oh and so she sent me some hello kitty and friends stickers cute it's like holographic you get quite a bit of sheets in here i think you get four sheets so i'm definitely able to share some oh and look at the notebook awesome i'm using a lot of lo notebooks um lately because i'm having to document things for the doctors so that's coming in handy for that so thank you so much girly and you are um like i said entry number 67 so moving along to 68 we have one from leslie okay so she had a little um arrow pointing where to open the box from so that worked out perfect here is the little card here oh so cute so tiny but so cute it's all layered up it says happy birthday on there very pretty okay so this is um crafted by labor of love and she does have i know for sure instagram i'm thinking possibly youtube as well so thank you she did show this um so oh i love it definitely keeping that it's a really pretty color look at this little bag that she did uh, let's see where this opens from right here okay look how cute this is she did, um, I think this is, I'm not sure whose die this is from, if either KS Craft or Scrap Diva, but she made a little um, box out of it. So again, that's her information. So pretty. Love it. I like how she used the palm trees. And then, oh, so cute. It's like a little acrylic uh, beach chair. We got a seashell really pretty floral cluster here of course it's a fun shaker another cell uh cell shell it says sunshine this is so pretty look at the handles so cute she's that um pink mesh very pretty and then let's see she put a couple things in here oh this is this is actually a memory dex card she double-sided that is so cool wow that is so cool that's gonna go in that box too wow that is so neat thank you and then oh, these are so cute she made little seashell looking rosettes and she has a base for them that is so neat i've never seen anything like that perfect for like a 3d project wow so so cool and then look at the back topper with the embossed um, mermaid tail it says treasured on there that is so beautiful she made another one it's such a really pretty die it says carefree I love mermaids like mermaid theme so that's so pretty and then here's another one that she actually used on top of the back topper with lots of different die cuts and layering and then oh my gosh this is like a wreath that she did she layered a bunch of different shells and then added these really pretty starfish 
with beads and um, or flat backs. So there's even like sequins in the middle to give it shine. Beautiful. Absolutely stunning. So cool. Thank you so, so much. This is so pretty. And then we have the next one coming from Brenda. Okay, so this is from Brenda, and she also has a YouTube. Oh, how funny. <laughs> she included some fun candy. I was just um, telling my husband that I had some packages to film, and, you know, they've demolished all the candy that I've recently got from my previous entries. And I was telling them that, oh, I'm sure someone's going to give me candy. And I was right, so he can... <laughs> they can fight over this Kool-Aid popping candy. I've never seen anything by the Kool-Aid brand that does this. So that's really cool. Yeah, that's going to get demolished. Oh, wow. Look how pretty this is. I love this trim. It's like that peachy pink. Okay, so. Get this fun shred out of the way. So pretty. So she made like um, the loaded bag. It's not a bag. It's that loaded, po loaded pocket. I love this die. It's so perfect for swaps and happy mails. Her... <coughs> information's right here again i will definitely leave it in my description box so she did a little pocket uh, window here that's really pretty she layered some tool she has some acetate pieces some tickets some flowers let life surprise you so pretty love it so here's a card look how cute the card is I like how she used the frame. It says, you are enough. So pretty. Thank you, Brenda. So, um, like I said, she's Live Love Craft here on YouTube and Instagram. Ooh. She used the, um, she reused the Woodland Grove packaging. But look at these fun little shaker florals. Those are really cute. They remind me of, like, mushroom. Like, the print of a mushroom. She included this cute little paper clip. Those are really pretty. And I can further embellish those. Ooh, these are so nice. Look at these felt bows. These are beautiful. And then she included this shaker butterfly for the back topper. I love me felt bows. And I love how she used gold in the center to wrap around. So darling. I love them. Oh my gosh, she shared some embellishments. These look like store-bought. I really thought those were store-bought. Look at those. So she used like vellum as the paper. These, um, where did you get this dye? This looks like those charms. Yeah, this is, let me know, Brenda, where you got this dye. I love it. And then the tiny little flowers. I'm pretty sure she made those. And then here's some more butterfly embellishments. So stunning. Love. And then, oh my gosh, she included bows and flowers. You guys are just uh, giving me everything that I want. <laughs> I love them. All the colors. Look at these beautiful flowers. Look at the centers of those. Those are cool. They're like little flat back gems. Oh, that's a cute idea. These are little, like, flat back roses that she used as, um, or flowers that she used as cinders. I wonder if those are brass or just flat backs. Those are really cool. And then the last one here, another fun shaker butterfly. And then she all, she, um, did some little chunky rosettes here. I have those stickers. I think those are the stickers from Hobby Lobby, maybe. I love how she did this. She had a floral, says live your life. She has like eyelash trim in there. 
they're just beautiful very fun and then look at the umbrellas oh my gosh so pretty it says make it count she even added bows on there on the bottom of the handles i love the gold touch there it says live your life these are stunning wow absolutely beautiful oh and there's one more thing in here she included this like little box of beads let's see if i can pull this off okay here we go so cool and i have a bunch of these too in my stash oh she included some wire wrapped beads these are beautiful beautiful if you guys are still here watching, put um, gold in your sentence that I know you'll want to be entered in like a little hidden giveaway that I'm doing at the end of the challenge. Let's get this to go in here. Love those. I do not wire wrap that way. Yeah, just put gold in your sentence in your comment and that will enter you. Look at these bows. Those are cool. They're out of felt and they're like all blingy. Those are really pretty. So fun. And then we have, oh my gosh, these are so tiny. These are so cute. I love tiny things. Look at all these cute little, little um, tassels, like flower tassels. Oh, they're dropping everywhere. Pick them up. Those are so stunning. I don't have any that small. I have tassels, but not like those. And then what are these? Looks like charms, maybe? Oh, yeah. We got some butterfly charms, some bow charms. We have like a little tiny star, a little heart locket. What is this one? Oh, my gosh. That is so small. Where did you get those? These are beautiful. There's another one here. Very pretty. Thank you so much, Brenda. You spoiled me. And honestly, I don't even know how you got all that in that pocket. <laughs> this was like full. Amazing. I just love how everything looks put together. It's so beautiful. Thank you so, so much. Oh, and I have one more. This one is from Maria, my friend. Pretty crafty. Um, yeah, pretty crafty. So let me put this together back in here okay and then we have the last one here so Maria will be from will be entry 70 and she made me a pocket letter because I did I don't know if she did a VR actually I can't remember whoops Let's get you guys back on here. Okay. Oh, wow. I think something fell out. Let me make sure I get everything out of its package. So there is a little note in here. Oh, I see something else. Yeah, a few things fell out of the pocket, I'm assuming. Um, let me grab it. Sorry guys. Okay, there's a couple like flat backs. We have this bow, these flowers, this ice cream. It must have fell from the back of the pocket. We also have this one here. Look how cool this ice cream is. It's a chunky. And then oh look how pretty she is. She's done out of diamond dots. I'm gonna add that to my journal. All right, so she did, um, oh, thank you. <laughs> we have been friends for quite some time on YouTube, lots and lots of years. All right, so she included some goodies. She included these Happy Halloween stickers. They're one of my faves from Jolie's, so I'm super excited to have some extra. And then she also included these really pretty gem bows. Very nice. Thank you, girly. Those go with everything. And then look at her fun pocket letter. So she did like a summertime vibe one here. So something must have came out of this. But look at this bow that she did. Or I don't know if it's like an embellishment. 
it's it's like um, out of sprinkles this is a really cool and then she used some other trims very pretty it says I love you to the beach and back this one says happy days with the lighthouse we have this really fun Sun cute little um, flamingo there with the she sells those are so pretty and then we have some more stickers this one says vacation I like this the splash of water how cute that she did that to kind of cover all three pockets and it has like glitter on there fun 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 thank you Maria and so yeah I think those flowers came out of that pocket so there's an extra one there she included this um, really pretty daisy trim this one I'm gonna call it some pools we have this die cut here which I'm definitely gonna use like a little floaty there so yeah I think the other stuff came from the pockets and there was also some dew drops that are, I think are in the bag that she also included here so thank you so much Maria I'm so excited that you were still able to participate and that is all that entries that I have for you guys as of now so um like I mentioned um I'm pretty sure there's going to be more coming in because I got a lot of messages um yesterday because today's no, Saturday was the 31st, so Saturday was the day I was getting a lot of messages. So yeah, I'll leave everybody's links in my description box. Show them some crafty love, and I will see you guys all in my next one. Bye.